all right so welcome back to my channel uh we are starting a series on you know setting up kibis for recording and we are going to go over step by step on recording your vocals and mixing and everything from basics you get so today's video we are going to be setting up our audio interface for recording with our microphone so this video is going to be very quick and in the next one we are going to set up our recording tracks in order to be able to record so without wasting time let's go right into the video all right so, so we are here in uh kibis and i've created a project it is very easy to create a project once you lo launch kibis 13. Uh, you just come to new project and then it is simple you select create empty project and it will prompt you to you see hold on it will prompt you to select a folder and save the project and that's it it will create a new project and then here we are we have created a project so the first thing to do on setting up your um sound card is to you come to studio studio setup and then audio system this way we are going to select our audio driver so under the audio system we have our ACO driver i advise you pick according to your driver uh your sound card if you are using the focus right sound card you must have installed the uh, focus right usb audio in uh, driver so select it if you are using any other sound card please do select install and select your driver but in my own case i'm using a generic plug and play sound card so automatically it has installed driver which will work inside of issue for all or inside fl studio ACO. but in this video we are going to make use of fl studio ACO because i'm recording myself and i need things to work in real time faster so i pick fl studio ACO. And then I come down under the audio uh, system. I pick the driver I've selected. Then there is control panel that will pop up on the side here. You click it. Then this is where the settings will happen. First thing I would like you to notice is select your microphone. If you are using a generic like me, select your microphone, which I have selected here. Your microphone, which is the sound card microphone input. But if you are using focus right or any other driver it might be different automatically all these things will be selected uh, so you just twist it and what we are going to set is the buffer size the buffer length which is very important if you are recording it is advised that you put your buffer length very low around 256 when you are recording vocals and when you are mixing when you are using effect and stuff you should keep it high to up to 248 in some other uh, drivers might be 1024 but in my own case 248 but where i like to keep it most of the time is around 512 so i like recording with some effects so i like keeping it around 512 so that it won't you know be laggy so 512 i like to keep it that way so i've selected then boom we are done at this moment i think we have set up our mic uh sorry our audio interface but sometimes we might still lose signal if after doing this and you're not getting signal that means your audio connection is having problems so you come back to the studio and then you click on audio connection which is the first one that is f4 that's a short code then you come to the input here and output and you have to be sure that your inputs are set correctly so if the inputs are not set correctly if you are if they are writing like this not connect not connected like this that means you won't get signal so you will connect it back by clicking on the driver then you see connected the same on the output the same so this output are your speaker outputs, speakers output left and right. And then the input are for your microphone. Microphone on your sound card. That's input one and input two, which is two microphone input sound card I'm using here. If your sound card is just one input, it will show just in one. 
so everything is right so we are done setting it up very simple but we have to test it to be sure that the microphone is working and we are having signal so i'll just create an audio track very fast and then i'll on it so we can hear it might be echoing all right, all right. you see you, see, you can, can hear, hear me, me now, now on, on the software, the software. so let's record something quickly to be sure that our settings are right because in the next video we are going to talk about setting up our tracks for recording all right test 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 testing one two one two this is a recording test how to set up your sound card and microphone for recording in cubis so let's listen all right test 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 testing one two one two this is a recording test how to set up your sound card and microphone for recording in cubis so we are done you can see we have signal everything is set so in the next video i'm going to walk you through on how you can set up different tracks how you can route your tracks to different groups how you can create effects for your you know tracks and so on in the next video so please do stay tuned like subscribe comment and share we'll see in the other video peace out